Hey everyone, welcome back. It's Jojo with and Shrutspa. We're doing a special <laughs> session. <laughs> we have emotionally prepared ourselves now. Uh, have you? How many times did you loop the song though after we finished many, reacting? Many, many. वो वो दिन तो महरम का ही था. हाँ. पूरा दिन महरम बजा. अगले दिन I was like, if I if I begin the day again with that. my day will be gone so i can't i really needed to work that day so i was just like no i need to focus yeah, so i yeah. i didn't so now it's become like a, a emotional portal for me i yeah. listen to mehram only when i know i have the next half an hour one hour to like just be with myself nahi to nahi karti main yeah and when i don't need to see everyone or meet everyone that puffy eyes will yeah. happen and red eyes will happen yeah. <laughs> and so, also want to relish it i want to relish that yeah. and the emotions it it's pulling out of me i don't want to share that to anyone else wo mere aur mehram ke beech mein chal raha hai rehne do mujhe it's a very solitude thing this song yeah. <laughs> uh but uh, we are not in solitude we have to watch this bts now everyone's been requesting it so we're in solitude with you we yeah. are going to watch it together <laughs> let's do it i'm excited yeah. chalo 1 2 3 play coke studio season 14 Song is called Mehram. It's such a beautiful term to describe everything: abandonment, you know, <laughs> khali pan, or all what you see in the space. Zulfi Bhai called me. In his words, "A ballad should be, which in my mind doesn't come. That you can't write better than him. First of all, the first thing for me is that he was very honored. He thought that in the whole country, for him to write such a song, he thought that he would write the best song. He said that the universe conspires. जब इस तरह की कोई अच्छी चीज बड़ी चीज होनी होती है जो एग्जैक्ट चीज उन्होंने मुझसे मांगी मैं उस चीज से गुजर चुका था और मुझे था कि यार एट सम पॉइंट मैं लिखूंगा तो जब उन्होंने मुझे बताया तो मैंने कहा कि यार इससे बेहतर क्या प्लेटफॉर्म हो सकता है इससे बेहतर क्या बंदा हो सकता है जिसके साथ में गाना बनाऊ फिर आई वेंट टू चित्राल आई रिमेंबर एन आई स्टे देर फॉर कपल ऑफ मंथ्स जिसमें मेरा ये प्रोसेस चला जो भाई के साथ कॉन्स्टेंटली हम इन टच थे और मैं एक एक करके चीज़ लिखता जा रहा था जो पहली लाइन आई थी तू मेहरम ना रहा मेरा और मुझे खुद जब लगा कि यार ये लाइन है आई सेंट इट आई जस्ट रोट इट ना आई सेंट इट और उसके आगे उनका जवाब आया दिस इज इट फुल स्टॉप एक्चुअली के डायलॉग बिटवीन टू पीपल जहाँ पे दोनों एक दूसरे को ब्लेम नहीं कर रहे किसी चीज़ के लिए लेकिन बस डिस्क्राइब कर रहे हैं कि हाउ वॉज इट वन दे वर टूगेदर एंड हाउ इज इट नाउ दैट देर नॉट just something that just really spoke to me right away and checked all of my boxes oh. Oh. this is the right word this was the best performance for it is sir sir bola diya yes mission accomplished kitni dafa tum ye shoot karoge ki i am on the verge of crying <laughs> <laughs> i was like is pe main sab ko rula dungi और ये मैं कर सकती हूँ <laughs> मुझे ये गाना आप दे दें आप दोनों की आवाजें भी पता है ऐसी हैं मुझे तो थेरेपी लगती है आई टू गॉड आई डोंट नो व्हाट इज देयर क्या और आप किस तरह डिफाइन करूँ मैं रूज का पहले से बहुत बड़ा फैन था उसकी आवाज़ का और उसकी आवाज़ के अंदर जो हॉन्टिंग वाली फीलिंग है और वो ये मेरे ख्याल से उसके आने के बाद ये गाना उस डायरेक्शन में ज़्यादा गया है क्योंकि नेचुरली गाना मांग रहा था being a part of a project like at home where like everyone speaking urdu and somebody's like oh hey chup kar jao action like you know what i mean like i've never been on set like that and it's just been like so surreal and so fun for me like i can't believe it's taken this long to actually be a part of this this organism mera khayal hai that's changed my life sherry 
You're good, baby, Aaron. Yes, I'm good. Yeah, actually, this is Aaron's uh, first song on drums for Coke Studio. And cutest. And let me show you another guy. <laughs> baby Asad, the youngest member of Coke. Aww. Look, guys, it's safe to say that this set. मतलब स्पॉट ऑन है गाने के हिसाब से फर्स्ट लिसन के बाद ही जो है ना विजुअल आए थे जेन में और उसको किसी तरीके से क्रिएट करना था और इसकी जो भी लुक निकल रही है उसकी लाइट उसकी जो एम्बियंस है सारी थैंक्स टू आमिर मुगल और डी ओ पी लाइट इज आल्सो म्यूजिक सो ये सोच के लाइट के ब्रीफ यही थी कि थोड़ा सा मूडी रखना है पूरे सेट की जो लाइट है ना वो 360 के बेसिस पे की है कि हर जगह पे आपको लाइट प्रॉपर बैलेंस मिलेगी यू कैन मूव अराउंड द सेट हर जगह पे आप जाएंगे आप शूट कर सकते हैं The entire concept of this song basically came from these two people who are in separate spaces, and both have had a very different part of a relationship that they remember. So that reminded me of the story of the chakor and the moon, जो हमारी एक local story है, जिसके अंदर जो chakor bird होता है, वो सारा वक्त रात को moon को देखता है और वो कहता है कि मैंने moon के पास जाना है, but he can never reach the moon. So it's a very beautiful, sad story. And secondly, the story that Asfar uh, was telling about a lost uh, sahiban or a partner. I felt was very similar to the story of Bulbul because Bulbul हमेशा में पैर में नजर आती है. So that became the basis of the song and these two people, जिनकी कलर पैरेटिंग कपड़ों की spaces की हमने उन birds से उठाई and with that we created these two spaces. अरुच का जो room है उसमें we have like a half moon window at the back. जो अस्वर का apart है if you look at it everything's covered in plastic. He's trying to save these memories. So when they both come into the space, you see these sprouts of vegetation which may or may not go anywhere. Oh. We're kind of channeling everyone's natural personal style into the wardrobe that I've aligned. This is the color palette that we have going on. We're playing with blacks, grays, a little bit of pops of maroon and red here and there. एक तो मैं सैड हूँ क्योंकि दिस होल सिचुएशन पुरस्यू इन दैट मूड बट एम सो हैप्पी एट द सेम टाइम के दिस एक्चुअली हैज बीन डन टू एब्सोल्यूट डिटेल उस जगह जो भूली हुई जगह होती है उसकी पता नहीं वो वापस आ सकता है कि नहीं आ सकता इन माई ओपिनियन इन दिस कॉन्सेप्ट नहीं I started uh, my interest in music as a musician probably when I was 15 or 16. I started playing acoustic guitar and learning some covers. I just realized that I was a complete obsessive about music and that was the turning point for me. I was like this is something that I have to do otherwise I don't think I can survive this world, you know. She means every word she says. Every word she says and so is us. and they are very articulate about what they are saying you understand each word mm. you know so when that happens na you don't have to even try to feel affected you just feel affected and that's the kind of song that will stay with you for the rest of your life hear it like 100 times and every time it hits as hard as it should so this song will be very special out that way is tarah na karo you move karo We're gonna start our soundtrack. So wish us luck. New steps, man. I select my team on the basis of the sensitivity levels as well. They have to be emotional. They have to be expressive. So such people will get affected by this. And if the only way to perform artistically is to get to by is by getting affected. Yes. I mean, every time you listen to it, it's surprising. के और उसके साथ गिटार्स करना है नॉन वर्किंग विद सच टैलेंटेड म्यूजिशियंस सो इमोशनल सो इमोशनल इट्स मेकिंग मी क्राई दैट्स द थिंग व्हेन यू जब आप सैड सॉन्ग्स बनाते हो आप खुद हंस रहे होते हो और लोग इधर-उधर इधर बिकॉज यू हैव यूज्ड द सॉन्ग टू थेरेपीसाइज योरसेल्फ सो यू आर डन बट देन इट्स नाउ बीइंग हर्ड बाय अदर पीपल एंड अब वो उनकी हीलिंग शुरू हो रही है एंड दे आर क्राइंग एंड इट्स प्रीटी फनी यस थैंक यू तो ये 
सारी कुर्सियां भी यहां पे जो प्रॉप्स यू कैन रियली सिट ऑन अ चेयर इट विल प्रॉब्ली ब्रेक Pakistan we are a country of extreme culture poetry dance music you know like look at urdu the language itself there's no limit for people like us where we come from we are done Uh, <laughs> yes, it was beautiful. I haven't had this much fun in a very long time. Yeah, same here. I think music is definitely a therapist and a lifesaver, and in all bad times and good times, it has always kept me grounded. Nothing else really has. So yeah. I thought I was prepared for it. No. <laughs> I thought if I listen to it, I mean, इतनी बार सुन चुकी हूँ ये गाना कि मुझे लगा यहाँ पे and इतने breaks में आ रहे हैं तो आप गाना भी नहीं सुन रहे. But it's the moment that music started right at the start, and it just it just takes you right there. Yeah, it's the, the song has grabbed everyone in the world. I think now. बस ये गाना अब like if you just hear one little half a you know tune of it also, that's it. You're gone. You're gone. This song is. It's a, it's a legend. The song is something else. I was just thinking through, like, like you said, I was, I thought I was prepared, but I was not because, um, because everybody who's contributed to it, when you see um their angle to the contribution and you hear it from them, um, yeah. you it adds another layer to your understanding of the song, and yeah. then and then it becomes that much more deeper for you because you and 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 I love that Zulfi said he he puts his team together based on their sensitivity levels because yeah. uh, if you don't let things affect you you will not be emotionally invested in creating it right so yeah. um yeah. so that that process that starting process of selecting the team is coming up like it's it's really showing in the results because. um even when i heard the set designer talk and like i i was about to burst into tears when he was describing how they put the set together with the two stories you know and Beautiful. the half moon and the nightingale and then um the you know the the plants that are sprouting but you don't think they're going to go anywhere like they're not going to become trees there's no future they're just there and they're random you know like just the thought behind something like that on the set i was like Kiro, I want to cry right now. Uh, you know what this is reassuring me for? जो हम सब बहुत ज़्यादा overthinking करते रहते हैं ना videos देखते हुए. We don't overthink. We're on the right track. Exactly. We're fine. We're good. <laughs> you don't need to. We're sorted. Yeah. This kind of overthinking and and detailing and just like yes, yes, it's wow. it's it's what adds to the magic. Um, but you know, um, what I really like, uh, loved seeing. one of one from from his writing the the second he wrote tu mera na raha mera like that was the line and that line i've been i i didn't want to tell you this but i was singing it all day like it and and like when i sing it's terrible singing so uh but just singing that line and humming that line has been making me just like break down like it just fills you up that just that one line forget the rest of the lines of the song which are insanely beautiful but uh you know when you see something uh and it just you know that this is it you know that this is the thought um that i love that part and then i i really really um for some reason hearing um her talk um and her tell like you know she's talking about arush she's talking about um how she, one she's never been around a team like this or a set like this it's a whole new thing for her so the experience itself of probably coming in and doing a show like this uh back home is is a new ground for her and then i and um but what what i felt was she's a very vulnerable artist but she um she is probably someone who's understood her role in the music space in the sense that she um she feels very deeply um yeah. and she lets the feeling wash over her and and you know because when she said that yes this is my kind of song mai logon ko rula sakti hu is pe please ye gana mujhe de do i was like she understands what she can do with her voice and and when she gets like she said ki i have used it to be my therapy 
but now I have to make it therapy for others and, and let their healing begin. So yeah. the second she said that, I was like, man, this is a very, 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 not just evolved artist, but a very evolved human who understands their role in the world probably yeah. and I don't know how old she is um, but I feel like that's that's probably someone who's been on a very you know roller coaster emotional journey through life and all of that but when like music she said helps you through everything and music is the lifesaver she said that at the end right so I feel like that is like that just those few lines from her talking about her involvement with the song on the surface she looks like a very like you know um, a composed person like but there's so much going on inside her that she's dealt with on her own and then she's made peace with whatever emotion she's felt through the song and now she's like okay now I need to present it to the world so they can they can hopefully find solace through this through this song and through my voice so I think that's beautiful to see like I'm just I'm just in love with her already as a person yeah. and an artist I'm in love with this entire team right in the start when they yeah. showed them sitting in the studio and they did the first rehearsal or probably one of the when we saw it in the BTS for the first time when all of them are sitting and both the singers began singing and then how they said that you know her voice was missing and then it came in suddenly the song became complete and yeah. his voice also the way that haunting quality and the way yes. all of it came together yes. it was just too beautiful and Zulfi said at that point no that they, both their voices have this therapeutic quality to them yeah. which he can't explain yeah well Magic. yeah we are feeling it the same. I, and i know yeah. so many others who are feeling it exactly the same way it's a fact this song is pure magic kuch hua hai jo every you know every frame they didn't need to do much the way the art direction of the set was also done every frame looked like a piece of art and that is like when something you know when even the minute parts look like art and even yeah. the voices are like that and uh, another thing with all the people normally when we say that you know produced by this one whatever these people were involved the back-end team was this is this, this you don't realize you know the broad broad categories of what everybody does but yeah. this bts is also showing us in detail what people do when sherry yeah. khatak is talking to everybody and getting the whole thing together i am realizing his role as you know, what he does in the whole Coke studio thing that much more via yeah. this BTS. Yeah. So it, it's it's very beautiful with the whole element, just like a huge appreciation, you know, shout out to the BTS team for Coke studio. You guys and are doing a fabulous a job. Fabulous job. It's so required yeah. and it's so well put together. And, and, and speaking of everyone's contribution, the drummer was, you know, someone new. I think he said first yeah. time on Coke Studio, even, even the baby, someone, baby Asad, yeah, baby one someone, of the younger. Yeah. The one of the younger. I'm just like such a young team and probably their first time on the show. And just look what they're putting together. I just... Fresh blood. <sighs> freshness of coke studio <laughs> i know so that's what i was saying like the the you know youth is uh, you know it's it's not a sort of disadvantage by virtue of lack of experience in the world but it's just that's by true. it's 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 a advantage in terms of your your earnest um uh, attitude and your earnest like desire to achieve and your like you know um just your earnest expectations of yourself and your life just the, when you bring that that kind of energy to the table it's a different it's it's different from experienced people you know there's no good or better or, you know it's just different and the energy um, i think that it's bringing to this season ah i can't well how much more can we praise this <laughs> we don't have any words left anymore uh, i, I have affected ke hum baat bhi kar rahe because we're so affected with it and so, i think that in effect shows it beautifully the thing is i'm just i'm just like the more i I see the BTS or, you know, artist journeys and, and hear even Zulfi uh, talk about the different, different moments and uh, the way his thinking process has been. I feel like breaking down so many times just watching the BTS. Forget the yeah. song. Yeah. Um, you know, it's like yeah. when you, when, like someone in the BTS even said, you know, sometimes the universe conspires. I think Asfar said yeah. that. Huh. Yeah. I almost broke down there only because I'm like, yes, 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 yes. Because um, I'm just saying that the universe conspires um, in, in such a big way because yes, the universe is conspiring all the time in everyone's personal really? lives. But like, um, but in this, um, like, I don't know, if it, it, it's so apt that they've titled this The Magical Journey because <laughs> the magic is clearly real magic because um, it's not conspiring for just the creators and the musicians and people involved in the show or, you know, they're 
personal lives and things like that. It is actually, there are so many millions of people around the world who um, unknowingly needed a song like this in their life at this moment in their life to, to provide them with some kind of therapy, you know? And anyone could be going through anything right now, sitting in, I don't know, Canada or Zimbabwe or some somewhere in the world, and they needed to hear this song and imagine the number of people and ideas and thoughts and everything that has come together in, in a conspiracy to create it for them in this moment in time. So I'm just, I'm rambling again, but these are the thoughts that one gets when one witnesses magical things like this. So oh, we're done. I think we're done. I'll bus, we'll, just, we'll just watch this and feel the magic offline. <laughs> but yeah. Thank you, Zulfi and team, everyone involved. Again, we cannot thank you enough. We just can, and on behalf of everyone who's enjoying Coke Studio season 14, yeah. just the biggest thank you from uh, our hearts. So on that note, um, we'll see you in the next one. Take very good care of yourselves. Uh, drop us a DM on Instagram. These are our handles. Do, 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 do. Please do support this channel. It really helps a lot. And we'll see you soon. Live long and prosper.